Bezos pages, best of the best book awards 2019. That's what you're viewing today, 2019 book awards for Pizos Pages, best of the best. I really don't have a rhyme or reason on how I really selected these books other than these books stay with me long. Uh, many of them are, st I'm still churning over. Uh, I read a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. Um, and I don't do all of the things with tracking and all of making goals and all of that stuff. I'm a book lover and I just like to read. And I don't wanna make it a competition or a challenge. I don't need to do that, I'm a reader. Uh, but that's great if some of you are doing that. A few ideas about how I really want to support authors more and I'm gonna do a separate vlog about this. But when I was doing this, I needed to look up a couple of authors and titles because some of the children's books, many of the children's books, once I read them, I give them away. Um, but I wanted to look up a title and I went on my Goodreads and said, oh, I can rate this right now. It's one of my best of the best and I'll give it a rating. And then I thought, oh, I can give it a quick little review. Ratings and reviews, just like comments on our YouTube pages, helps promote the book, helps promote the pay, the vlog. But if you really love something, you want to celebrate it, you want to let others know, get on Goodreads or some, whatever you use as your book um, online community and give them a rating and a review doesn't take long i did like four boom 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 in less than five minutes on goodreads i put the app on free app goodreads i looked up the title right there is the rating boom then the next thing do you want to write a review yes and then two little quick sentences and it's out there in the space to bless somebody else and to promote the author and the illustrator's work that's something that I plan to do a lot more of, which will probably mean I will be getting an actual number of how many books that I read. I don't know that I'm going to be doing that for every single book, but books that stay with me long. Because I will tell you, on average, I, I read hundreds of picture books a year. Hundreds. That's just, I put books in the hands of children and I need to see what's out there and what they're reading and how to help teachers. And so I'm, I read hundreds of pictures of books. I can't keep up with that pace with Goodreads. Now, if Goodreads want to pay a sister or if Goodreads want to sponsor a sister in some way, maybe we can work something out. But right now, I am going to definitely, those books that stay with me long, that really are the books that I would love to talk with a few people, those books... I'm going to be making sure I uh, review. Another thing about this process with me, I don't read based on what's coming out now. Some books I do, some authors I do because they are beloved to me. Jacqueline Woodson, she releases a book. I'm going to buy her book. I'm going to read her book. I can probably review her book. And, um, you know, uh, Renee Watson... Almost all her books that come out, I'm going to purchase. I'm going to re read and review. Um, also, uh, I'm trying to, oh, Beverly Jenkins. You know, I'm going to purchase. I am not may not necessarily read all of them just because I go by what I'm feeling. And some I read widely. So sometimes I, I want to dive deep into a nonfiction informational text sometimes i want to dive deep into a historical sometimes i want to dive deep into literary uh jasmine ward anything and everything she puts out i'm gonna get within that first week probably will pre-order so and and probably will read very quickly after i get it uh but not all books so this is not about books that were released this year the discovery of books it's like the discovery of life. It's a journey. And I truly believe that books come into your life 
oftentimes for specific points in time, specific reasons, you, you know, they can, because they are transformative and, um, oftentimes I'll just have a desire to read something. I don't really know what, and I'll pick up a book and it's just the right book. They're almost like scripture. You open up that word and boom, just what you need comes out. That's how I have a relationship with books. So I don't chase publication dates. I don't. I'm sorry if it doesn't help puff up, but I'm going to do better to help promote by providing a review as well as a star rating on the books that I read. But I don't chase publication dates. Just cannot do that. Can't afford it. Don't have the time. All of the above. Um, but there are certain beloved authors, Nikki Grimes, uh, I know I'm going to get in trouble because I'm leaving a whole bunch of people out that I get as soon as they produce because I love their work. I just love their work and I haven't been disappointed in their work. All right. So it's funny. Let me tell you about these really cool. I hope you can see that. Uh, trophies. So my sons, you know, my kids are all athletes and they all have tons of trophies and medals and awards. And I said, oh, I have awards. I want to actually have giveaway awards. Um, go back and look at the book awards where I use my accent. So I wanted to go and get, and I said, I'll just get like somebody doing a basketball or something like that. And when I went up there, these were on my son's shelf. And I forgot when I was a teacher, I used to have a boys reading challenge club and i will buy all of these books they love roll doll they love 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 the roll doll and i would buy a book for every kid and we would do we would read them after school they get a cool snack and then we read the book discuss the book and if they stayed the entire semester um at the end at the end of the school year they were awarded a trophy with their name on it. So it says boys reading group and the year with their name, with their name on it. And there's a book, an open book and a genie knowledge lamp right there. I don't know if you can see that. So that's what I would give all of the kids one of these. And I, I would have like 10 boys on each time, each semester. And so these were like a hundred bucks to give these really nice marble, can you hear that? Quality trophies. So that was something I did and I thought, oh, this would be nice for the Pizzo's pages. Best of the best book awards. So that's what this is. Woohoo! Um, so let's get going. I have been sticking to under 15 minutes on these videos, but I'm okay if this goes a little bit longer. Hope you stay around because we have some good writing to talk about. Good writing to talk about. And I'm even throwing in articles. Oh my goodness. I have been reading fabulous articles. Very, 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 very good. Very good. Uh, essays and articles. I'm just... Feeling myself, feeling like I'm part of a bigger uh, literary community. All right.